Dr. Maxis. What it is. I'm Kevin, Scorchard Gaming, and we are back on Moons of Madness. So, uh, last we left off, we got the batteries for the uh, water reclaimer. But we still need to find the controls for the sprinklers to turn them off. So, I think the only thing we can do is go for a bit of a wander and hope we come across them. That thing we need to activate last. Them dudes are dead. Am I wrong to say that when we looked over in episode 1 or 2, like, things looked alive? I might be wrong on that. Can't hundred percent remember. There might be a door we missed. Uh, so maybe we need to activate a door. If you're gonna end on it, nope. I think there's an area down under these stairs. That's the broken door. That's where we were at the start. Okay. They're running in those cages, actually. Like, something broke out of the middle one, but... Okay, there's nothing in the others. It's more of that nasty-ass growth. So we're in there. Some of this stuff is alive, but... All that down there is dead. Try go up here again. The only thing I could think of is on the walkway. That's where we were at the start up there. Does this bring us to the walkway or do we need to go over to the other place? Oh no, this brings us to the walkway, so maybe there's something up here. It is very difficult to see, so. Uh I imagine it's going to be even worse for you in on YouTube. Oh, this sprinkler? Might be a sprinkler. Okay. Okay, so there's one more sprinkler, so we'll stick up on top of this some bitch. Okay, that's where we came up last episode. I can barely see a damn thing. But we got the sprinkler. Jesus! Oh! What the fuck? The fuck was that? Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. Just turn on the fucking water. Holy shit! Fuck! <laughs> My heart's racing after that. I was not expecting that. Ooh. Okay, so we're just getting into the spooky now. A freaky. Okay, so we need to get these to 80. Uh, actually? No, too much. It's splitting it in a weird way. I got this one on. Let's put this on a hundred. Now we'll try that. If we lower the middle one, that should do it, hopefully. What's this on? So let's try 90. up and running again. Just need to switch on the environment control console. Should be right outside the door. Perfect. Thought I hit the fucking door. Let's get this fucking fog to dissipate. 
Oh shit, the trees are alive. Declan, are you there? Declan! Declan, help me. God damn it, Declan! What the fuck? Oh my god, that is uh, fucking what is nasty. That? What the fuck are you? Uh, no thanks. Oh, fuck. Oh shit, where am I going? Oh my god. What the fuck is that? Oh, that thing is behind me. Oh my god. How the fuck am I about to get away? Where am I going? I don't know where I'm going. That thing is so fast. It's right in my ass. Kind of says faster, you son of a bitch. Holy shit! Holy shit! No. Go. Fuck I'm going down here. I thought that was the right thing to do. Oh shit, no it wasn't. I'm not fast in the water. Climb. Oh, we're fucking back here again. I was talking about the goddamn gratings. Oh shit. Did that? Oh, oh! No, thank you. I don't want whatever you're selling. Fuck away from me. Nasty tentacle mouth motherfucker. Oh shit. Come on. Why can't I fucking jog in this water? It's not that deep. Get out. Oh no. Where the fuck did, uh, can we get out here? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Open, 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 open. No, stay out. There's a horrible creature in the greenhouse. It tried to kill me. Do not return to base. Anybody? Does anyone read me? Ina, Lucas, Commander Wilcox. I've got to warn them. Uh, I don't like that I am not getting anybody. Uh, let's not put a helmet. <laughs> Maybe there's something in the base we can use. It's gotta be some fucking radio or amplifier, maybe. I mean, Mars is a big place. We'd be forever trying to find where they at. So far, it seems like the only thing we can do. Okay, yeah, we're gonna just wander the uh, surface of Mars. Hopefully we'll find somebody. Holy shit. That was fucking intense. Thing was not letting up. See, that makes me think there's someone in this section still. Or was. Are we doing oxygen? Oh, this needs oxygen. Okay, we gotta calm down. I know, I know what we saw, we shouldn't be calm, but... I mean... We're in space. We should try to keep calm. If I can get to Declan at the satellite station, we can try to re-establish communications. Okay, perfect. Then the Meerkat. Open up. Patiently wait. Patiently get on. Patiently close. There we go. Okay, let's get to the satellite station. You gotta be real careful in this fucking thing. Not do a turn and crash to a goddamn rock. Okay, that's just a dust storm or something. I thought it was like smoke. And it seems they had a bit of a fucking mess there. That's another one of those fucking like, drilling machine things. Those things seem to just be causing problems for everybody. Let's 
Top up the oxygen. Okay, we've calmed down as well. We're far away from that thing. We fucking better be. Uh, excuse me? What the fuck? Declan? There's something wrong. Where did everything go? Yeah, let's not go towards the big, spooky, green fucking Martian light. That is not where we came from. <laughs> we have to go to the big, spooky, green fucking Martian light, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, we do. Why are those rocks, like, so neatly lined up there? Well, the big spooky light. Hello? Why is it glowing? Okay, so... <sighs> Fuck me. Wait. We're not in a spacesuit. This ain't the giant's causeway. The orb is reacting to my hand. Shit. What's going on? Why is this happening? Some weird ass fucking key? It's burning under the skin. Uh, no, no thank you. Go away. There's some I didn't notice back there, though. Oh, doesn't like that. When I turn to look at it, it retreats. Okay, retreat. You son of a bitch. Hey, I'm still looking at you. I was gonna say, it doesn't matter, but the angle that I was at there when we held our hand up, where it's cut off on our thumb. I thought the picture there was cut off, but no, that is not the case. It's just the angle. Three connections, all pointing to individual orbs. Fully powered. I hear you, you motherfucker. Get the fuck away from me. Let's go a bit closer to it, get it out of here. I see you. Get the fuck out. There's something moving down there. Get out of here. I am right here. Okay, it was nothing moving. All right, well, let's go back. Cause, uh, have some shit to do. Get out of here, you cheeky. The orb is glowing. Come on, hurry up, hurry up. We got everything. There's nothing. We're missing an orb. Get out of here, you, you son of a bitch.
Man, I don't think we can actually read that. Oh no, maybe, okay, maybe we can. Let's do that. I'm gonna stay here for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, yeah, so I think it pauses. So let's have a quick read of this, or try to. Uh, okay, look. There we go. Where am I? Sleep is no place to call its own. Who shall conceive of the terrible wonders wrought by my secret labor? Will they, will they who sleep reward me? Punish me? Will they even notice? The children of Mars worshipped a being whose name roughly translates to the Immaculate Machine. These orbs are artifacts of that mystery cult. They are filled with, powered by, that celestial light, anima. The light drives back the dark, but also the liquid enlightenment of the dreamers. What the benighted have called Nurgle's rot, the black worm, jism, and the, the filth. I'll reclaim the term from the unenlightened. I'll call it the filth, because it stains the mind, pens the illuminated text that rides in the wrinkly tome of the skull, the crawling muse. But it saturated my mind too much. A page to dipped a page to dipped entirely in ink is as black as a white page, meaningless madness. The effort to write is the text becomes legible. But what if I can could drive back the filth just a little. If I had a little more of my human thoughts back, I could do more with the thoughts beyond human. I could achieve such marvels that neither the human play nor the liquid dreams of the sleepers could accomplish separately. The orbs are corrupted, but I can fix them. Yes, they who sleep will notice me. When I wave into the infinitude of the abyss, it will smile back. I'm guessing that is Dr. Volkov. But we need an orb for this. Right now it's just powered up. Get out of here! Won't get! Bad tentacle. Is the orbit need? What the hell is this place? The orbit decays. Where am I? Sleep has no place to call its own. My name is legible. I'm still on this planet. Easy. I will write down my method for writing reveals. I take the vermiculated orb and change it using the machine. I fabricated from the Martian schematics. Supercharging the anima burns out the infecting filth. It works, but only for the moment. The flare of the supercharged anima burns itself out momentarily, allowing the zero point dagger pathogen to take root again. What if I soaked it in the pool's ethereal sound? I will achieve it. Can't see what that name is. Whoever was here was trying some kind of experiment. And they fucked up. Messing with everything. Okay, now we can't. What have we got here now? First two lines the same as the last one. Today I vomited in today I vomited in disgust on my failure, and what I vomited up tried to crawl away. Looked up pleadingly as I killed it. Easy. You are a scientist, aren't I? There are no failed experiments, only more data to collate. Yes, the orbs are corrupted from their original purpose by the sibilant frequencies of the filth, so I commanded the black worm jism to leave the orbs. But the filth is stubborn. It will not give up the corpse of its enemy. It is a light source, I suppose, but I do not require light. I have not used that the bovine jelly of my sockets for some time. The what? What the fuck is bovine jelly? Well, I just noticed that wall is moving. That's gonna, oh, something's gonna come out of there. Oh, man. Okay, we'll find out in the next episode, though. I'm gonna end this one here. I hope you enjoyed, and, uh, yeah. Seems we're getting into the creepy, and it seems that we are isolated on the, on Mars now, other than that 
weird motherfucker that popped up. But I hope you will join me as we continue into this spooky trip of madness. Hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one. Sayonara.